All right, everyone. Hello and welcome to Hexa Parkour. This is a parkour map made by Amerika Kaj. You can see he's right behind me. And it's kind of crazy. Apparently, this was supposed to be all cubes and he just did the command wrong and it came out as hexagons. I see a bunch of bees. But yeah, this is going to be pretty wild, I think. Uh, there's a little information tablet here you can pause and read it but yeah this is a Pokemon where everything is made out of hexagons it's pretty cool um i've seen the rules that's all good there is training over here which i will go to just to see what it's like now i oh okay yeah sure we've played a bunch of america car maps before tons oh i was not meant to go that i was supposed to go on the slime block that makes a lot more sense how do i get back up here is it oh i, I don't even know how to get onto those ladders is it like this Surprisingly tricky just to get back up, but anyway. I played a bunch of America Car maps before. I failed again. Man, this isn't a good start, is it? I guess I need this training. Why is this last slot red? That's weird. Oh yeah, I do have a little me on my head. I'll talk about that in a second. Um, yeah, we played a bunch of America Car maps before. We played Parkour Planet. We played uh, a planet. Uh, yeah, Parkour Planet. We played... What was the other one called? Parkour Islands? Yes, Parkour Islands. Okay, well, we've, we've done that, the training. Let's just... Go ahead and leave. Let's actually start them up. Oh, a little wand. Settings. Oh. Ah. That is really cool. Right click on the changes. The production quality has really gone up <laughs> in these maps. Run the fire. I'm on my own, but good to know you can turn it off on and off. Uh, level tablet sidebar or action bar. I'll go with action bar. I like it on the action bar. Collectible. When you see the uh, when you get close to a collectible, particles appear above it. Click on the block below to collect. Oh, there we go. Collectible checker. Right click to check how many collectibles you've found. I don't know what this last slot is, but I'm not going to put something in it just in case. Oh, I see. Okay, that's really cool. This is kind of insane already. This is way higher production value than usual, but man, Amerika car maps are always really nice, really great. So I'm expecting this to be just good. It's it's always going to be good with Amerika car. Um, but yeah, I do have a little stemmy store in my head. I believe that's something that only I can get. It's there's a command block or something detecting whether it's me playing, um, whether it's my username or my UUID, probably just username. Um, and it gives me a little stemister, which is really, really cool. Um, I know America Car watches my videos. He's in my Discord. You can join it. Link is in the description if you want to. Um, yeah, it's. I was not supposed to jump up there. I am glad I missed. Um, but yeah, it, it's crazy. Oh, I, I I was too busy looking at the action bar, the thing just above the hot bar that said I had half a heart, that I just didn't look where I was jumping and I just hit the ground and died. But that was cool. It was a temporary dropper. That's really, really cool. That's a cool concept. Parkour into a temporary dropper. Man, the make car is crazy. Also, it looked like I teleported there. I'm not sure what happened. It looked like I teleported, but I don't think I did. I, I, that was weird. Oh, maybe I did teleport. Now I'm in, a, I think, a different hexagon. I'm not sure. Anyway. <laughs> um, what was I talking about? Yeah, the little stemister. It's crazy how I get put into these maps by the Blue Man, um, America Car, Lion Tark. I, I don't know why I'm in these maps. I know I play a lot of maps, but I mean, I only have... I have less than 3,000 subs. It's crazy. Is this a teleport? It is. That's really cool. Yeah, less than 3,000 subs and I, I get put in these maps. It, it's it's wild. I think I was supposed to jump on that. That's why it's a different colour. It makes a lot of sense. Um, You might have noticed already that I'm running kind of through these levels. Like, oh, an animation. Very cool. Um, Kind of smooth. Like... It looks like I know where I'm going. I don't. This is the very first time I've played this. That's a cool wall design. I like that a lot. Um, what are those fences? Oh yeah, just nether brick fences. Yeah, they do exist. I forgot. Which one am I going now? This way. Um, yeah, as I was saying, I'm running kind of through these as if I know where I'm going. I don't. It's just really well made. <laughs> I think the map is just really well laid out. It's easy to know where to go. Um, <clears throat> I think I will be playing this more than once, by the way. You can see there's a, a time on the action bar along with the stage number. Uh, this first one is just to get a general feel of the map, see where I'm going roughly. And then the, the next run will be 
me trying to go as fast as possible. I don't know if there's a leaderboard or anything. I was not supposed to jump there. See, that's why I'm doing it twice. <laughs> so we can get a better time than this. Where do I go from here? Um, That way? I don't think it's that way. Isn't this... Yeah, that's where I just was. Hmm. Where do... Oh, I, I failed. I'm not too sure where to go from there, but I'll figure it out, I'm sure. I hope. Um, yeah, I, I do want to get a, a decent time. It might be a leaderboard, that might not. Oh, I dropped down. I don't know why I ignored that hole in, in the gold. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> See, it's really obvious when you're not talking so much. Tiny bees, look how small. Oh my god. Can I take them? Uh, I thought maybe they were an item that I could pick up by right clicking. They're not, but they're so cute. Man, there's so many really, really nice attention to detail things in this map. And just like cool ideas, like the dropper earlier and the honey making it a little bit harder to see. Really, really cool. I, I think this is the right way. There was a lot up there that I just didn't even pay any attention to. I teleported again. Um, <clears throat> I think me being able to see the teleport is less a fault of a smooth transition and more just because my resource pack adds randomized textures to the stone and stuff, so I can see when it changes. So, that's my bad. I was not supposed to jump there, I don't think. Maybe down here. <laughs> Makes more sense. Actually, has somewhere to go. Alright, stage 11. We're getting through it pretty fast. It's only been 4 minutes, nearly 5 actually. So maybe we'll finish in about 20 minutes. Which is a decent time, I think. Especially for our first run through. And um, that's like 30 seconds per level, roughly. You know, I knew it was going to be something to do with jump boost. I thought it would be automatic though. I, I thought it would just boost me up so I didn't even jump. It makes more sense that I need to jump. I'll jump this time. There we go. <laughs> yeah, really cool. Um, it's, it is reminding me a lot of the Blue Man maps. I, I don't want to, I don't, you know, I don't want to make any drama by comparing at all. It's not what I'm trying to do, but the Blue Man obviously has like speed boosts and, and oh, I almost made that. You can definitely make that. And jump boost pads and anti-gravity and it's crazy. Um, and it's not something that I've seen all that much from Mamiya, but I'm glad he's doing it because this is so far probably one of the better parkour maps that he's made. He's made some crazy good ones, but the production value on this is crazy. It's so good. Oh uh, man, I, I've realized I've not... Oh, I missed it again. I've not made... I've not collected any collectibles. Um... I'm sure they're hidden and you have to explore for them. That's unfortunate. I don't really do that though. I don't really explore for collectibles much. It's not my thing. Oh, I, I'm sure you can make that, but I've missed it three times now. Next time. If I get to it next time, another time, I mean, I'm making it. I swear. What is that? It didn't... Oh, it... I think I just overshot the block. This is not going well. A restarter. Right click to restart your run. Oh, all the way from the beginning, I assume that is. Latest death, I forgot to turn that off. Oh no. That's fine, we'll just ignore it. I don't know why I keep jumping on that wall. It's... It's tempting, I don't know. Maybe there's a skip that you can do from that wall. I made it this time, there we go. I said I would. I said I would get it, and I did. Okay, this time, I'm not going to overshoot the heads. The heads, I mean... I don't know why I jumped on that. These things. Sandstone blocks. Come on. There we go. Oh, there's more. Go, 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 go. I assume they fade after a little bit. And that's why the, the pressure plate, like, solidifies them. And then you gotta get across before they go transparent again. Yeah. Very, very cool. I like it. I, I, I'm also... I'm always impressed, not just with Minecraft maps, but with games in general. Uh, when there's a really cool concept. Where do I go? Down here? Yes. Uh, oh, my bad. Oh, hello. Uh, an MS Ruhi plush. Design level 13 and 33. Can be equipped on head. I mean, I got mine, so I'll just keep mine on. Keep my plush on. Um, yeah, I'm always impressed with games and Minecraft maps when there's a really, really cool concept. 
that they only use once. I was not supposed to go there. I don't know why I just did that. Um, too busy thinking about other things. Yeah, when 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 games only use a concept once, it shows that like they they have this cool idea and they don't just they they don't milk the idea. It's I don't know how to phrase it, but I find it really cool. It shows they don't want to get stuck on one idea and, and just like make it, you know, use it so much that it gets boring. And I've noticed this is doing that a lot as well. I think I jumped down to there. Yeah, the, the Amethyst Arrow is pointed down here. Ow, my legs. I nearly died. Well, I didn't, but, you know. Yeah, it, it, it. Things can get boring very quickly. So, doing them and then moving on is, is really, really cool. There's a lot of waypoints. I think they're death waypoints. Oh, that's a lot of speed. Um, yeah, I, I should turn those off. I will in a bit. Uh, I just don't want to pause too much because of my time. You know, it's I'm at nine minutes already. I'm not even on stage 20. I'm behind pace. Ah, but that's fine. I mean, I'm sure the levels get harder and harder as you go. Oh, turn around. Got it. Thank you for the sign. Appreciate that. Yeah, the levels do seem to be getting a little harder and a little longer. I need to stop saying that. I say it, I always say it and it just sounds weird. Anyway, on to the tree. Ooh, okay. I think, hmm. Oh, the Elytra section. A classic when it comes to a Mirka car maps. Oh, that was cool. That, those arrows look cool as well. I think they were animated. Do I go backwards or up here? I think I... Oh, it... Oh! <laughs> animated wall opening that I didn't even realise. Was that always happening or...? I, I don't know. <gasps> A crown! I want it. I know it's a collectible and I, I said I won't go my way to get those, but... I got it! Um, can I... Oh, there we go. I got two. Why is it... Oh, I pressed it twice. I have two collectibles. There we go. Um, I'm trying to think what else there is in that collectible list, but I don't really recognize any of the symbols. Maybe none of it has to do with me. I wouldn't be surprised because I've already got a plush on my head. I don't need more than that. Oh, I almost just ran straight off. Ooh. I probably could have and just made it, but dangerous. Alright, uh, 10 minutes in, almost 11, and we're still not on stage 20. These levels really did get longer. And more difficult. There we go. Where do I go? Is it down there? Ah, yes, okay. It's getting a little bit more complicated on where to go, but it's really not bad at all. It's You look around for two seconds and you know where to go. I assume up here. I don't know if you guys saw that on the action bar. When I was stood up there, there was a picture of a slime on the action bar, which was... Jump into the hole! Oh, okay, okay! <laughs> I'm floating up, I guess I go... A fade to white transition? Hello! <laughs> your head pretty hard with... <laughs> Boy, you're back to the... something. I wasn't supposed to do that. Okay. Um. Drowned in orange juice. Is that... I mean, it doesn't say Owen, so it's not an Owen juice reference, I don't think. It just says orange. Oh. I've fallen again. I just want to see what's in these pipes. It just looks like concrete powder. So pretty cool. Anyway, this is a sudden change. I like it a lot. Um, there's something about like clean simple parkour you know the the last bit was very organic you know it looked very natural all the dirt the cost dirt, the stone um but there's something about lab i guess style parkour very simple jumps that is satisfying to me it's very it's just it's just parkour it's, it's plain it's simple it's clean it's nice not to say this is bad or anything i think this looks better and overall is better, like the natural look of this area, but I don't know, something about just the clean look satisfies me. 
it's not very nice to not very nice to look at um when it comes to youtube oh down here i see onto the drip leaf that's pretty cool and up here yeah oh, it's not very nice to look at when it comes to youtube but i just like it i don't know this is definitely getting more difficult it's, it's still not that tough really i assume down there into the water yeah i'm gonna have to climb up all of that aren't i drop her into climbing all the way up anything cool in there any collectibles i don't see any I'm just gonna carry on oh i'm going straight in there all right that makes sense you see the outside world i was supposed to jump up there uh, yeah, we still only have, only have two collectibles. I was meant to make it up to that. I I mean, there's, there's a lot that I've not explored, right? Like, I could go over here and explore. Or, 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 I, or I couldn't. But what I was trying to say is, there's a lot that I've, I've not explored about this map. Um, I've, I've just been running through and trying to get a, a decent time to start off with. Which I've just noticed my time is no longer on the action bar. Maybe it'll come back at some point. Um, <clears throat> oh, we're going up. Yeah, I, I'm i sure they're hidden around the place. And if you want to download this for yourself and try to find them all, please go ahead um, support and make a car as much as possible. Um, the best way to do it is by downloading his maps. And um, yeah, feel free to look around. The link will be in the description. Um nether section. I've talked before about how <clears throat> a lot of parkour maps have this progression, like this aesthetic progression. It's, it's you know, it starts very overworld-like and then it goes into a nether section and then the end is the end. The dimension, the end. Um, and it makes a lot of sense, but ever since I, I started talking about that, I've noticed that's not really the pattern. Maybe it's just how it used to be in parkour maps, but now, like, I'm back on a very overworld-looking place. Hey, Bale, thank you for telling me. Oh, I was not supposed to jump down there. I'm glad it reset me, because that was an earlier checkpoint, and if I hit that, I would have had to do so much more again. And I, I wouldn't want to, so I'm glad it, it reset me. Thank you for that. But anyway, yeah, it doesn't really have that aesthetic progression anymore, which is totally fine. The arrows on the leaves make a lot more sense. Very cool. The the amount of custom models and... Oh, this one's a bit tricky, isn't it? Oh, that was the right thing to do. I just missed the jump. But yeah, blue to orange, it says. It's a difficult jump, though, man. No, it wasn't. I was just being stupid. Okay, so that to white, back to pink, to white again, to red... <laughs> this is really cool. The blue. No! How did that not make it? What? Ah, oh, okay, let's try that again. Yum. I have totally forgot what I was talking about, so I'm just going to move on. To white, to red. Oh, to blue. That makes a lot more sense. To yellow. To add a slime to red. That's fine. That's okay. I'm surprised there's not, like, there's a reset stick to reset your entire run, I assume. But I'm surprised there's not one to take you to, take you to your last checkpoint, just in case you somehow glitch out of the kill zone. And I can't make that, right? I just missed it last time. Yeah, okay, yeah. I, that's fine then. I, I just, I just messed up. To there? Yeah. Alright, got it. Um, yeah, I'm surprised there's not a thing to just reset you to your checkpoint. Maybe this does reset your cheat checkpoint, but I doubt it. I think I just skipped a couple of jumps then, because I'm a speedrun god. Um, yeah, I mean, that was pretty nice. I'm sure there's... Alright then. <laughs> Some nice little attention to detail with the logs in the water. Interesting. Oh, never mind. It's, it's parkour. That's just looks really cool. I liked it a lot. Oh, I keep forgetting. I keep getting distracted and then forgetting what I'm what I'm talking about. It's frustrating. I need to stop doing that. Anyway, I think we're getting yeah we're getting fairly close to the end. We're on stage thirty almost. I think this is the right way it looks. It. Um. So we're going into the final quarter. 
final, yeah, the final section. Kind of. Was I supposed to go down here? It looks like it, maybe. Oh, yep. This is new. Make it, thank you. Okay, yeah. Got into the final 10 levels. I think we can do it in the next 10 minutes. I saw it. Dynamite stick, be careful with it. Alright, there we go. Uh, stand here. Crouch to ignite the cannon. Press shift. I think I pressed shift more than I was supposed to, but I don't know what happened. I feel like I'm supposed to get shot over there, but nothing's happening. Maybe I just hold shift. Okay. I think I was just supposed to hold shift until it actually exploded. Um, maybe. I'm not exactly sure. I, I probably... And I just didn't hold shift long enough. Slime! I, I didn't see what I was supposed to jump on at first. You gotta look before you jump sometimes. Sometimes. Yeah, I like I messed up with that cannon. My bad. <laughs> but at least now I know what to do next time when I'm trying to complete it as fast as possible. Now I am only gonna, gonna have one speedrun attempt. Um, and there's a very good reason for that. I've not eaten in about 20 hours. And I, I have food on the way. I'll be taking that. Please. Oh, come on. Negan's bad. Oh, no. Oh, I mean, maybe he can't kill that one character now that everybody liked. Didn't want to die. The Walking Dead reference, if you don't know. I, I think. I'm pretty sure. Anyway. um, Yeah, I, I have food on the way, so... I, I need to go get that. I don't have all the time in the world to record today. But yeah, I, I feel like one is going to be enough. And as always, I was not supposed to jump there. As always, you know, if you want to download this for yourself and try to get a better time than me, feel free. The link is in the description. I keep going around in circles because I am not sure where to go from here. Is it that way? That seemed like a big jump. Like, it's, def it's easily possible. But it, it just seems like... I wasn't supposed to, but I was. Okay. That's fine. Yeah, it's, it's an easy enough jump. Not even a, a max distance jump. Alright, stage 33. It's It's got a lot slower at level progression since about stage 20, I've noticed. Levels are, are going up very, very slowly. There's a wider distance between the checkpoints. That's okay more parkour for me. I like it. That was a cool room. Very colourful. Very YouTube friendly. Ooh, the staircase. Oh, so satisfying. I tried to build one of those once, but I, I didn't look at a tutorial or anything. It went terribly. I, I made like three blocks and then I, I got stuck. I didn't know what else to do, so I just gave up. But oh well. Alright, stage 30. Almost five, I assume, once we go through this thing. Yep. Oh. Well placed water. Fell straight into it. Oh, that drags you down. I really thought it'd push me up. Okay, that's good to know. I'll, I'll keep that in mind next time. I think we're going this way. We are indeed. Ooh. I really need to get rid of all those death points, and I will once I do my speedrun attempt. But I mean, you guys won't really see that. I'm gonna. Ooh. I'm gonna kind of skip through that part. So, ooh. almost fell again. Okay, now I know that drags me down, I'll land on the, the stair block to not get dragged down. Nice and easy. Ooh. That was a close jump, I almost hit my face on that block, but I somehow missed it. Anyway, this time, let's actually make that jump. Pretty, pretty tricky one. You don't see the hole until it's too late. It's, it's... I can't think of the word. My man's gone blank. Doesn't matter. Where am I going now? Is it back down? Oh! Uh, no? Is it? No. What do I... Huh. Hmm. Oh! I have an emote on my Twitch, which is me with a blindfold on. Oh, my Minecraft character, I guess. A drawing of my Minecraft character with a blindfold on. It's called Stem is Blind. 
that's where you would use that emote. You know, I, I'm not very good at seeing things sometimes. My vision is fine. I just... I don't look around enough. It happens all the time. That's why it's an emote. Oh, okay. I... Was supposed to hit the slime blocks, I guess? That's... That's a weird concept, but I like it. The upside down slime block hit. I died then? Ow! Oh, I think I died of fall damage. Uh, yeah, I died of fall damage. That, yeah, okay. I, I only have half a heart. That makes sense. I, I didn't pay attention. Like, I saw it, and then I immediately forgot I had half a heart and just jumped. <laughs> oh, that was close. That was a very, very close jump. Man. Whoa! I didn't see the water end. But there we go. We're back in. We are getting close to the end, though. Very, very close to the end, and my time, I don't think is very great. These are some weird textures, by the way. What is that? Quartz with coral on top? Is it supposed to be like that? I think it is, but it looks very, very weird. I don't know why that's a thing. Quartz pillar with a red coral on top? It seems like it's not supposed to be a thing, but I, I don't know how that would be a mistake. Seems like a difficult mistake to make. I'm just going to assume it's, it's bright, it's normal. Oh! I just realized what I was talking about earlier, about how the the visual progression, it, it it's back. I'm near the end, level 39, and I'm in the end. Oh, I make a car, brought it back. I don't know why I'm jumping up there. It's obviously these slime blocks. It also says in the action bar. Ah, I'm, I'm stupid. But we are getting very close to the final, final level, and here it is. The last level, of course it's diamond blocks, how fitting is that? A classic. The mighty diamond block. Nice and shiny. There we go. 40 stages. All done. Hello snake rattler. <laughs> A tiny little snake rattler. MS Rohi. A tiny little lion tack. All, all, all testers. And of course the creator, Emir Kaka. Very, very cool. So we can go back to the start. There's all the other maps to check out. Parkour Islands, The Great Fall was a good one. Uh, Planet Parkour and Planet Parkour 2, all very good. Uh, yeah, okay, so 26 minutes and 34 seconds. That's my time to beat. I'm going to quickly have a run off camera um, so I can fully concentrate. I don't need to be distracted by talking and stuff and see what time I can get. And then you guys are going to have to download the map, try to beat my time, see if you can. Where do I restart? Right here, okay. I'm going to go do that. See you guys in a sec. And in my one and only speedrun attempt, I managed to get 17 minutes and 40 seconds, which is okay. I did make quite a lot of mistakes. I forgot to turn off the death thing. There's a lot of deaths. I made, yeah, quite a lot of mistakes, actually. Um, I could definitely get a sub-15 with the time if I had a, just a few more attempts, maybe. Sub-15 is definitely possible, but I'm going to leave it there. So if you want to try to beat that, the link to download the map will be in the description. And before I go, I did actually find one more... Uh, collectible you can see in the bottom left, I found me. It's another little me. It's a Stemister plush. Uh, yeah, I got the Stemister plush. Um, the original was the little Stemister. I managed to find the Stemister plush. It's I can't remember exactly what level. It's somewhere before level ten. Um, but yeah, there you go. I I am in the game, which is again, which is really really cool. Um, thank you, Amir, for putting me in the game twice. Um, I appreciate that. It was really cool. But yeah, this was a really really fun map. It's Probably the best America game map so far. Insane. Um, I enjoyed it a lot. So feel free to download it for, and play it for yourself. But that is going to be it for today. So if you liked, be sure to like. If you really liked and want to see more like this, be sure to subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching. And see ya.